It is only appropriate that on the first day of March, the boys' basketball tournament would begin. Madness has arrived. I'm Griffin Stroyan. That is Eli Karp. We're going to kick things off between two great Northern Conference opponents going at it. Ryan Lander versus Anago. Griffin, during the regular season, the Hodags won both matchups, but the, the Red Robins hope to pull up the upset tonight. Both games were pretty close, decided by 13 points was the largest margin, but this one was not. We'll pick up things in the second half. It's all Hodags, 57-28. That's Trevor Terrace nailing, nailing a three for Anago, but there's not too much else to speak for them. Nice pass from Jackson Zettler to Ty Welk for the short floater to put the Dags up by 29. And some more good ball movement here. Zettler's going to get another assist and find Will Gretzinger for three. They're again up 29 and here, a nice, powerful take. Jackson Smith, the point guard, with the left hand, make it 63-37. to 37. Connor Coles played well for the visitors, but he gets a tough layup to go. It just wouldn't be enough. This one was over early. Everything coming up, Ryan Lander. They're moving on after a 74-39 to 39 win, and they'll face third seed Shano for a trip to sectionals. Lakeland Union also in action against Wausau East, eight and nine seeds. Face off in what was expected to be close here in the first half. Lumberjacks came out shooting it well off the scramble. Gabe Napkazek nails a corner three to open the scoring. Lakeland would hang in it though early. Off the quick action, Ryan Carlson nails the jumper and that becomes 11-5. They're down just six. But the night would belong to Wausau's Dylan Bookberger. The six foot eight center grabs the offensive rebound, finishes, and puts his team up 20 to 12. Looks like he's hurting there, but that didn't affect his performance. Nice short floater here as the T Birds answer with Braden Wycheck. That makes it 20 to 14. They're down six again, but sometimes size cannot be overcome. The missed three, but there's Bookberger again. He goes for 26 points. Wausau East cruises 76 to 50. They'll face top seed Fox Valley Lutheran in the regional final. Our final game in Division Two, Merrill hosting Ashland. We're going to pick this game up in the second half. Blue Jays are already up big. A great cut by Braden Piper. Driving baseline makes the tough layup. Merrill is up 23. Bailey Turing says, hey, maybe I'll get in on this dance. Pulls up, drills a three, and then a quick steal. I missed it. Yam it home right there for two. Blue Jays are just having fun at this point. Big man Tyson Glitch. Hey, get in on the action, why don't you? A deep three for him. Nothing but net. And then to cap it off and transition, Jordan Bush and one layup. The foul, and I don't get this celebration, but I'm all for it. Merrill wins big. They get to take on second-ranked Mosinee next round. Moving to Division 5, Rib Lake on the road taking on Athens. In the first half, Rib Lake moving the ball quickly up that court. Jackson Blomberg, he gets it down low, finishes the layup for two. And then on the other side, some great defense, though, from the Blue Jays. Cooper Dietrich, quick hands leads to the steal. An even better pass to Evan Gorleski. He finishes the layup. Puts Blue Jays up three. Rev Lake would keep this game interesting, though. Great pass inside. Blomberg's going to finish again at the rim. Athens, though, was the higher seed for a reason. Nice pass to Cody Lepic. He finishes it off the glass. Blue Jays win 63-49. to They'll host Bruce in the next round. Now some area scores in Division 5. Three Lakes absolutely annihilated Wasaki. 89 to 16. They'll face Niagara, who went on the road and upset Elko 64 to 54. Those two teams will face off in Three Lakes this Friday. And then the fifth ranked Schwamigan Eagles took care of big business against Boyceville 62 to 41. Expect a great game this Friday as they travel to fourth ranked Unity. And finally, Prentice beat up on Mercer 94 to 50. The Buccaneers will travel to Solon Springs next.